Hello guys, welcome back. In this lecture, we will discuss about another important SQL clause and that is order by clause. So when you query data from a table, the select statement returns rows in an unspecified order and to sort the rows of the result set or in the resulting relation, you need to use the order by clause in the select statement. Order by clause is used to display the SQL query output in any specific order. By default, it always returns the data in sorted order, but you can mention explicitly if you need the output in descending order. Okay, but if you use order by clause, you must provide at least one argument or at least one attribute on which you want to perform ordering. And if you wish, you can perform ordering ordering on multiple attributes as well and we will see the syntax of both kind of SQL queries where we will use order by clause okay so first let's see the order by syntax for a single column here you can see two queries on my console that select star from table name order by column name okay and here you need to use order by clause after the table name and by default this query will return the output based on the ascending ordering of your column name okay and if you want to output based on the descending order of the column name you need to explicitly mention in the query okay select star from table name order by column name desc okay so this desc keyword is required if you want to perform ordering in descending order okay and you can see the example syntax here however this is very basic use of order by clause but if you want to perform ordering on the multiple attributes or column then you need to mention all such attributes okay for example you can see that we want to perform ordering in the ascending order for multiple attributes like column one column two then you can see the syntax in the query one that is select star from table name order by column name one column name two okay and here you need to notice that you just need to use the order by clause once and then mention the attributes on which you want to perform ordering okay and again since you did not mention the ordered way so it will perform ordering in the default ascending order and now you can also perform ordering like uh, one attribute as ascending and one attribute as descending and you can see the syntax of query in the second okay so select star from table name order by uh, column name ascending and column two as descending okay now it's time to try the order by clause practically so first switch to the terminal and open the psql so switch to the terminal and here run sudo hyphen u postgres and psql okay now since we have an employee table okay so let's try to fetch all the employees first so what we can do select star from employees okay and run this query and here you will see that we don't have any specific order of the records these all are uh, visible to us in the order which they inserted or updated okay here you can see that like uh, there is no specific order inside the id and no specific order inside the name and the email ct salary and so on okay so no row is in a specified order okay so now let's run the order by query here on the name attribute okay so when we run the order by query on the name what we will get we will get all the name in ascending order first okay so let's run select the star from employees order by and here we can perform a v here we can supply name column name okay and when you run this query you will see that now all the records are displayed based upon their ordering on the name or the lexical order of the name so here you can see that all the name are sorted here okay and uh, then rest of the attributes are displayed based upon that okay now if you wish you can perform ordering on multiple attributes as well uh, but before that let's uh, try to display record in descending order so here you can run let's say order by name as descending so you can use desc keyword here and now you can see that all the records are displayed based upon the name in descending order okay now let's try to do the order by clause on multiple columns okay so let's say name is ascending and email is descending so here we can do select star from employees order by name is asc and email 
DESC. Okay, and run this query. Now you will see all the records based upon that name in ascending order and email in descending order. Okay, and here you can see the we are getting the different table than other now one here you can see we what we are getting id as 21 to 16 14 18 and in this query what we are getting id as 22 1 3 because now we are ascending the records based upon name is ascending order and email is descending order okay and you can perform the same query again with the id attribute let's say id is descending so now you will see a different result set now okay and here you can conclude one more thing that when you provide multiple attributes in an order by clause then the ordering will perform in the chronological order of the attributes that you provided in the query for example here you can see that we provided name as ascending and id is descending so what this query will do that first it will order all the rows based upon the name and then it will process the order uh, then it will process the result sent result set based upon the id as descending order okay and this is how the order by clause will work okay and that's all for this lecture so here we learned about the order by clause and now in the next lecture we will see how to work with order by clause and where clause because there is some difference uh, when we use uh, both order by clause and where by where clause in a single query okay meanwhile try this lecture at your end and we will meet into the next lecture till then tata goodbye take care and Stay safe.